Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your6 Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to see the difference between the 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz connections on your Fire Stick. So you know which one you're connected to. So just on the home screen here, let's go all the way to the right. And then go to settings and go to network. Just like this. Then you can see the ones I have available for me. You can always go to see all networks and scan for it. But I know these ones are mine and I'm connected to them. So I got Miss Beast, Mr. Beast, and then I have Scump down here. Those are all mine. I have two different routers. So let's go to Mr. Beast and connect this one. Since I already have it saved, I don't have to type in the password anymore. Then press the play button on your controller or your remote. It'll bring you to this connection page. And you can go to run speed test and you can just go to continue. And that's calculating in the top right. Now, if you look at the top, it says connection status. Mr. Beast, 2.4 gigahertz. So this is my 2.4 gigahertz connection. And uh, this is good for longer ranges. So if you got something really, really far away, you might get a better connection with this one versus your five gigahertz connection. But you're gonna notice my download speed is gonna be probably a little bit slow. So this one says 95 for my download. Okay, let's go back now. Go to Miss Beast. And then connect to this one. Press the play button on it since I'm connected. Run speed test. Go to continue. And at the top, this is connection status, Miss Beast, 5 gigahertz. So this one might be better uh, for shorter ranges and it's going to give me a better download speed. So you can kind of just do this test back and forth yourself if you have two different options. And I believe uh, most routers nowadays they have multiple different options. So this one should be quite a bit faster. This was 280 versus the other one, which was uh, 95. So maybe you have uh, this option in your router settings and you just have to enable it, but just make sure you're connecting to the five gigahertz because this one's going to be the faster download speed usually. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out. Did leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more check out videos coming up next on your six studios.